Zoo New York gets funding from Watertown to open up for the spring, but its further future remains up in the air, as we hear from 7 News reporter Brennan Straub. Closed gates at Zoo New York, but soon they will open again for the season, thanks to money from Watertown City Council, $100,000. The vote, close. Three yes, two against the funding. Mayor Sarah Pierce voted no and released a statement late Monday saying it's time to reimagine the space in which Zoo New York exists with a smaller footprint but still carries out the mission of the conservancy that promotes uh, the protection of wildlife and the environment. I think there are a lot of different things that we could do there. Pierce says it could be similar to the Minute Anthony Nature Center on Wellesley Island or the North Country Children's Museum in Potsdam. Council member Ben Schoen agrees with Pierce and says outside organizations like the Department of Environmental Conservation could take advantage of a newly imagined space. We have animals on display, we have land, there could be places for courses, you know, like archery range, stuff like that. The, the state could help us by paying for part of our operation. Council member Cliff Olney feels the zoo is an asset and could sustain itself if better advertised. First you need to understand what you're looking at and how both parties, uh, the Conservancy and the city, are going to be able to work together to make this work. And that has not been done in the past. It's going to happen now. To continue operations, the zoo is also asking the city for a long-term contract, seeking $375,000 a year for five years. But some on council say that amount may be too much for the city to take on by itself. The zoo is also asking for the same five-year commitment from the county. Council member Lisa Ruggiero agrees the county should be involved. We have so many more people that support the zoo and come to the zoo that do not even live in the city. Uh, I think that um, the burden should not be solely on the city. Zoo New York is projected to open for the season on May 4th. Brendan Straub, 7 News.